YouTube, what is up? I know I've already made a video about how to catch sturgeon, but I have stumbled across a way to catch sturgeon much quicker than originally planned. Now, if you look in the bottom right corner of my screen, I don't know if you can see that shadow down there. That's a sturgeon. Now, you can almost force these things to spawn. And just to prove it to you, we're going to catch it. So if you see, he's kind of in like the, the shallows of the river mouth. Uh, this is where these fish spawn, and you can see how large his shadow is. Um, let's catch it. As you guys will see, here's a sturgeon. There he is. And just to prove to you guys how good of a hack this is to catch these fish, check out how many I've caught. So if we go back and look at that, I have one, two, three, four, five, six... Seven, eight, nine, ten, and that was number eleven. I've caught eleven sturgeon on this deserted island since I've been here. Now, if you didn't watch the other video, we will very quickly go over the Critterpedia. These fish are available from January through March, and then again September through December. They are available all day long, and as you just saw, you can only catch them in the river mouth. Now, I'm sure all you guys are wondering, how the heck did I know that that was going to be a sturgeon? Well, when you come to a deserted island, you can actually force the fish to spawn down in the river mouth. You have to scare all the fish out of the river. If you just saw, I ran by, scared a number of fish, um, and you can also use your fishing pole, so if, if the fish like gets attention to it, you can uh, pull it away before you catch it, and it'll force the, the game to spawn fish in other areas. So like, I don't want to catch that fish. That wasn't a sturgeon. Um, we can. I'm gonna cast to see. Okay, there's not one down there yet. But if you come back out here and you force some of these other fish away, da -da 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 -da, scared him off. Uh, it spawned another one down here. A little fish. Come back up here. Come on, I need to just scare one of you off over there. This is the downside is I can't I can't get to that other side very easily without like hopping over. So I'm trying to just get one of them to like bite the bobber, and it should scare all of them off. Maybe. Yep, there it goes. Perfect. So now. Try to scare these off, really force the river. So a great way to scare them off is to let the, the fish bite the bobber, and then, uh, you know, you don't catch them, because these are junk fish. Let's go see. Well, it, it spawned another fish in the river mouth, but it's not the one we're looking for. All right, we scared him. Let's come back down here. Make sure there's not one on the far side. Look, there he is. See? That's how quickly you can spawn these. Now, just got to catch him. So, just to prove it that it is a sturgeon, because you can see how big the shadow is, and they usually spawn, um, like, in the very shallows of the ocean. So, just a second here. He'll take notice. And, oh, there he is. He noticed it. Let's get us another one. Oop, come on. There we go. We caught another one. So guys, if that doesn't prove to you that, that this sturgeon hack works, I, I just caught two of them in uh, like four minutes. Um, so yeah, th this should really help you guys catch a sturgeon. And uh, if for whatever reason this isn't working for me, please leave a comment down below. I'd, I'd love to hear about it. Also, if you guys would please drop a like on this video and subscribe to my channel, I'd greatly appreciate it. Thanks and good luck catching a sturgeon.